Hello, you guys. Maybe you guys are on tonight this late. Maybe you're not. Let me know below what's a good time to reach all my subscribers when I do things like this because I have no idea when, what time you all are up. When I do things like this, I'll try to be more active, but I'm not. Anyways, I got new glasses today. I told y'all that. I went for my God Butter ultrasound. Want another results in the two to, two to three days. When I go back to my doctor, and I'll keep y'all updated on that when I know something. Today, I'm going to read y'all what I wrote, which is what the inside of my grandma's house looked like when I was younger. It says, my grandma's house on the inside had the front door in which you walked inside where the living room uh, was. There was a couch, a bookshelf, a mirror, a TV, a reading chair, and another couch. In the living room, I mean a rocking chair. In the living room, there was a kitchen going into the kitchen window going into the kitchen which you could look out and out of and see a living room and the TV if you wanted to watch it. In the kitchen there was a kitchen table, a phone, a can with the sink, a oven, a refrigerator, my computer and my electric piano. By the refrigerator there was the utility room with a heater system and a washer and a dryer. Go to the next door by the utility room and there was my dog Phoebe, Phoebe's bed and go through that door was my Aunt Bobby's bedroom and a front door there too going into the backyard there was a swimming pool um, I'm just there was a swimming pool and a plate shed going back through the house there was a kitchen by my computer there was a bathroom and my grandma's room then my room and go through the other room there was my couch there was a couch and a big room window i used to sit on the couch and look And look out the window and a mirror that was brown and long and go through that curtain porch show as far as in the jungle gym. The the bushes was on the side of the other side of the driveway and my sister's handprints and my handprints were engraved in the driveway. Um if anybody wants me to do a grand tour of the bedrooms that I remember them in my, in my mind, I can do that. Uh, it doesn't bother me. You just have to hit me up in the comments below what y'all would like and what y'all would want to know about my life because I am doing this to give you all a perfect perspective view of somebody's life with a disability. Because I want people to know that they're not alone in this life. And, and you know, with the disability or with not, we're, n we're never alone. So please start commenting below on our photo uh, videos and comments and everything. Um, and please subscribe to Lizzie's Redbubble and look at Redbubble if you are not. It's a good website. We've done plenty of videos on this and we love comments and stuff. So please start encouraging, start, start encouraging her, please and thank you. We appreciate the 97. Let me check that again. We appreciate the. <laughs> Give me a second. We appreciate the. Um, we appreciate the uh, 97 subscribers. We appreciate you all. We thank you. Um, we thank you all so much for the 97 subscribers. Please share our channel. Please share our channel and help it continue to grow. Um, and once again, I thank you all. We appreciate you all. Hope you all are safe. Continue to be safe in this crazy world that we live in today. We love you guys. Bye. See you all later.